Hey, what's up, you guys? I'm back with another video today. Thursday Night Football. This rivalry goes back such a long time ago. The Green Bay Packers versus the Chicago Bears. The Green Bay Packers, they did pick up the victory over the NFC North Divisional Rivals, 23-10. The Chicago Bears, they did not come to play tonight in Lambeau Field, and they got their asses kicked. Even on the score, they look like they got their asses kicked. The way they played, they were horrible tonight. Jay Cutler. Only completing 40% of his passes, 126 passing yards, one touchdown pass, and get this, four interceptions. Four interceptions thrown to the Green Bay Packers defense. Now, if you guys remember, I don't know if you do or not, but a couple days ago, Jay Cutler, he came out and said, oh, well, Green Bay Packers defense, good luck with defending our wide receivers on the Chicago Bears. Well, you know what? Tonight, you guys needed the luck because you got your asses kicked and you guys played bad tonight. And you didn't back up what you said. So, I bet you're looking really dumb right now. And Jay Cutler, look, I'm going to give you some advice, man. Stop throwing so many interceptions. I mean, it's probably going to be hard for you, but you got to learn how to stop. That offensive line has to get better. And this is the question that I want to ask you fans out there. Leave your comments in the comment box below. Do you guys think the offensive line for the Chicago Bears will ever get better? You know what my answer is? Time will tell. It's going to take some time because that offensive line, it is bad. Jay Cutler got sacked seven times tonight. Seven times tonight by that Green Bay Packers defense. And he was talking all that crap and wind up seeing the Green Bay Packers defense actually play some defense because we all know they were ranked 32nd last year in defense last place and tonight they played pretty good on offense tonight Aaron Rodgers 219 yards passing completing 68 percent of his passes and one touchdown pass and he did throw an interception but the Green Bay Packers they came out with the win in the NFC North they are on top of the NFC North right now they have a one-on-one -on -one record, just like the Chicago Bears and the Detroit Lions. They got the San Francisco 49ers this Sunday night. That is going to be an amazing game. So that's probably going to be the next game that you guys are going to see me. This is your boy DJ Charlie. I'm out of here. See you guys on the next video. Like this video, share on your Facebook and your Twitter. And also make sure you guys subscribe. And oh yeah, I almost forgot. I'm not done yet. Brandon Marshall, he did come to play. Two receptions, 24 yards receiving and Matt Forte they lost the key player the um, Chicago Bears did he left the game he did not come back he left the game with an ankle injury so they better hope that he's okay that he's going to be able to play in um, week three next week versus the St. Louis Rams because they're going to need him back he is a key player to that offense he just signed a contract um, a month ago or probably a couple months ago I can't remember but they're going to need him back Greg Jennings he didn't play tonight for the Green Bay Packers and they didn't need him because they picked up the victory but like I said make sure you guys like this video share it on your Facebook and your Twitter and also make sure, you, make sure you guys subscribe to this channel peace out see you guys this Sunday it's going to be some good games coming up Colts let's get this victory over the Minnesota Vikings baby peace